Okay, so part two of the video in terms of how to uh, try and get measurements for when you're looking to replace something that's existing with something new. Um, so we spoke on, the, on part one about how to kind of measure external, what the aperture looks like. Part two though is more about making sure that you get the right threshold at the bottom. And that threshold is obviously uh, going to affect your finished floor level on the inside. Now, in this, this is a good example where we have a, a tiled floor finish that's on the inside and that sits above the uh, outside in effect. So what we've got to try and ascertain is how high that is so that what we take out um, isn't a lot bigger than what we put in, but too big. So we end up with a floor level on the inside above the threshold. The best way I can describe that is if we take... This is a good example. So this is an integrated seal threshold on the Corniche door. Really good, 150 mil projection, weather rated, but the internal height is only 52 mil. Now that's great, um, but sometimes that could actually be too low because in this instance, if I measured on the outside and I can see that the brick where the sill is sitting um, is actually more than 52 mil below this finished floor level, then what I'm going to end up with is a floor that sits actually above this, which we don't want. And what I don't want to be doing is lifting doors up, packing underneath where they're then more prone to drop in. Um, so in this instance, this might not be the right one. As much as it's lovely, this may not be the right one if that floor level is higher. You've also got to factor in things like what are you putting down? How big is it going to be? Underfloor heating, screed, tile, whatever it's going to be in measurements and then don't change your mind. So in some cases, good option, but may not be. So in this case for us, once we've worked it all out, we might find that a standard seal and a standard threshold is the right option because it's actually 72 mil and suppose for 52 mil, but that might just give me a little bit more height if I find that my floor levels on the inside are actually too high. So these are some of the things to consider. Um, we are always happy to help try and do video calls, talk to your builder, give you technical drawings so we can handhold you as much as possible because it isn't as complicated or scary as it might possibly seem but certainly things to discuss with you guys uh, when you're ready. Thank you.